Tim Busy Bee family. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ashley. I am a mother of four. I usually do daily vlogs, cleaning, fitness, health, pretty much anything to do with being a stay-at-home mom. And thank you so much for clicking on this video. It does mean so much to me. I wasn't planning on picking up the camera tonight, but I am extremely excited. I just got in this new product. It is this pumice stone. I think that's how you pronounce it. Pumice, pumice, something like that. But I am so super excited because if you watched my last cleaning video, I had talked about how I cannot get the stains out of my toilet because we have well water and the well water is super hard. And then we got a water softener, which helps some, but it is still super hard and I cannot get the stains in it. So if you have that problem too and you're looking for the solution, keep on watching this video. Shout out to my friend off of YouTube, Anna. I will leave her link in the description below. She is the one who told me about this, so I am praying it's gonna fix my problem. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, I'm back. Ethan woke up from his nap, so I had to get him back to sleep, but now I'm back. Okay, so I thought what would be really cool is to compare products. So while I'm working in the toilet with the pumice stone, I am going to use the Lime Away and this other, it's supposed to be a commercial strength toilet bowl cleaner. I'm gonna put that in the third toilet and let both of those set while I use the pumice stone and then we will clean them and compare just so you guys can see, you know, what's worth spending your money on and what works and what doesn't. So I thought that would be neat. To get started with the pumice stone, we have to drain the water out of the toilet. So I will show you guys how to do that. Let's get right to it. Okay, the first toilet bowl, we are going to use the commercial brand. So now that we have the stuff setting in the other toilets, we're gonna go ahead and shut off the water to the toilet so we can then drain the toilet bowl. So first, you wanna go to the back of your toilet and here is the little knob to shut the water off. Just turn it all the way to the right until it's super tight and it's gonna be turned off and then you're gonna flush the toilet all right, so now that we flush the toilet once, the next thing we're gonna do is grab a bucket and fill it up with some water. Okay, now it is practically empty and we're ready to scrub. You guys, I am so impressed. That literally took me only a couple of minutes and the stains came off way easier than I thought they did. Let me tell you, I have been trying for so long to get these stains out. I am so shocked. Like, look at that. That was only like two minutes of scrubbing. Okay, so now let me go show you. The other cleaners are still sitting. Let me show you. All right, you guys, this has been sitting for at least five minutes. Go ahead and give it a scrub. So many stains, it did nothing. Okay, now nothing. we're gonna go see the commercial grade toilet cleaner. Okay, when I bought this, I thought for sure it was gonna do the job. 
but in reality it actually just smells like the black Lysol toilet bowl cleaner. I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Okay. So let's go ahead. It's been sitting for like five minutes. So many stains. All right, you guys, by far that pumice stone is so worth the $8. I have spent, I can't even tell you how much money I've spent on different toilet bowl cleaners trying to get the stains out. And literally that stone took me two minutes. Yeah, you have to drain the toilet out. I'm sure you could do it without it drained, but super fast, super easy. So if you guys are struggling with hard water stains on your toilet, get you a pumice stone. I got it on Amazon for like eight bucks and it has an awesome handle. So you don't even have to worry about getting gloves or getting your hands dirty. And I will leave the link in the description below. That way you guys can check it out. Let me know what you think. If this video was helpful, please give it a big thumbs up. It does help support my channel. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.